Praise the Lord. I'm thankful to be here. My name is Joshua Rose. I deserve the hell of the guy saying me one day. I ain't got over it. I'm not going to go out of the day. God forgive me. But I'm thankful I'm saved. I'm here not going to get my wife without her. I got nothing in it. My wife is staying pleased with her name is Vashti. I call her V. But Jesus just call her V. You feel free. We're not offended. We just appreciate everything. And we deserve the hell. It's up. It's up. She's down here from here. Lord, took care of her. Praise the Lord. We're glad to be here.
this team he just preached about that love, yeah. that a piece of the pie also goes the whole pie. Hey, it all, hey, I love them Muslims just like I love yeah. you. Yeah. Just like I love your wife. Just like I love them children. Hey, I love that Muslim man. And God convicted my heart and, and two trips later in the camp meeting on a Friday night, a man drove about 15, 16 hours to preach the hour and then drove back 15, 16 hours to a church and he probably the next morning. That one Mississippi preached was uh, the Old Testament where Joshua and Moses were up on the mountaintop and, and they said it's not on the mountaintop. The camp meeting big times now. Nice. Monday morning comes, hey, how are we doing then? And Monday morning comes, we got reality. Hey, we're prayer, we got folks here, we got ministers to we can't meet the great, we need to go back. Our Come on, Christ with those we know that we need to share them to. And God said, Josh Rhodes, I need you to go to God in the church plan and share me. Share myself, share my word with those people. Amen. They don't need to be just those people, Josh. They need to be your friends. Yeah. They, need to be, they, they need to become family. They need to become ones you love. It's not those people. Hey, that's my friends down there. I got pastor friends down there. I got, I let them know that they call me a vagrant, a bum. But I know I'm a friend. Every time I'm a Trinidad, that three blocks away, Freddy, hey, what am I? He's riding on that bike as fast as he can. He jumps out. I'm aware of how How are you doing? You think we're brothers? And my wife made me get checked for last and everything I do. I don't care about none of that. Freddy knows when I see him. Hey, Jesus loves you, Freddy. You're going to go church with me, Freddy. And let me tell you about Jesus. Every time I see him, we do a whole bunch of time to get into church planners and, uh, and to preach. And that's what I plan to do this morning, amen. Turn your Bible to Judges chapter 7. And, uh, and you say, what's this got to do with campaigning or commissions or anything? Yeah. It's, it's in the Word of God. It's just in the Word of God. I'm trying to be faithful to Him. Uh, I'm deserving of hell. I'm deserving to follow my Father. And so uh, that's just what I want to do here today. He was those that can out of respect for the Word of God. If you stand, please, we read the text here. Judges chapter 7. And uh, we're going to read about a fellow named Gideon. And uh, God can use anyone. He's sure to use Gideon. Judges chapter 7, as I read here, verse 1. Then Jeroboam, who was Gideon, and all the people that were with him, rose up early and pitched beside the well of Herod, so that the host of the many nights were on the north side of them by the hill of Mora in the valley. And the Lord said unto Gideon, The people that are with thee are too many for me to give the many nights into their hands, lest Israel vaunt themselves against me, saying, Mine own hand hath saved me. Now therefore go to proclaim in the ears of the people, saying, Whosoever is fearful and afraid, let him return and depart the road from Mount Gilead. And there return to the people twenty and two thousand, there remain two thousand ten thousand. The Lord said unto Gideon, The people that are yet too many, bring them down into the water, and I will try them for thee there. And it shall be that of whom I say unto thee, This shall go unto thee, the same shall go unto thee. And of whomsoever I say unto thee, This shall not go unto thee, the same shall not go. So he brought down the people unto, unto the water, and the Lord said unto Gideon, Everyone that laughed into the water with his tongue is a dog laughing with him, shalt thou sit by himself. Likewise, everyone that bowed down upon his knees to drink, and the number of them that laughed, putting their hands to their mouth, were three hundred men, but all the rest of the people bowed down upon their knees to drink water. The Lord said unto Gideon, By the three hundred men that laughed, will I save you and deliver as many nights as thy man, and let all the other people go every man unto his place. So the people took fiddles in their hands and their trumpets and sent all the rest of Israel, every man into his tent, and retained those 300 men and the host of many was beneath them in the valley. And it came to pass the same night that the Lord said unto him, Arise, get thee down into the host, for I have delivered it into thy hand. But if thou fear, go down, go thou with fear of thy servant down to the host, and thou shalt hear what they say, and afterwards shalt thy hand be strengthened to go down into the host. Then went he down with her and his servant unto the outside of the yard men that were in the host. And as many nights we bowed guys, and all the children of the east lay along with the eye like grasshoppers. For multitude and their camels were without number as the sand by the seaside for multitude. And when Gideon was come, behold, there was a man that told a dream unto his fellow and said, Behold, I dream a dream, and all the cake of barley bread tumbled into the host of Midian. And came into a tent and smote it that it fell, and overturned it that the tent lay along. And his fellow answered and said, This Nothing else, say the sword of Gideon, the son of Joash, the man of Israel, for it's in his hand had God delivered Gideon and all the host. And it was so when Gideon heard the telling of the dream, the interpretation thereof, that he worshipped, and returned to the host of Israel and said, Arise, for the Lord hath delivered into your hand the host of Midian. He divided the three hundred men into three companies, he put a trumpet in every man's hand, with empty pictures and lamps within the pictures, and he said, Look on Midian, 
clockwise, and behold, when I come to the outside of the camp, it shall be that as I do, so shall ye do. And when I blow with the trumpet, I and all that are with me, then blow ye the trumpets also on every side of the camp, of all the camp, and say the sword of the Lord, and of Gideon. So Gideon and his hundred men that were with him came into the outside of the camp from the beginning of the middle watch. They had newly set the watch, they blew the trumpets, they break the pitches that were in their hands, and the three companies blew the trumpets and break the pitches. How the last in the left hand, and the trumpets in the right hand, to blow with all, and they cried, the sword of the Lord, and the Gideon. And they stood every man in his place, round about the camp, and all those ran, and cried, and fled. Let's pray. Lord, I come to you now, I thank you, Lord, for, for this opportunity, but Lord, I need you. I need you just like I did when I got saved, Lord. I need you then, and Lord, I need you now. I, I just want to be a voice, Lord, John the Baptist had it right, Lord, the voice in the wilderness, and Lord, all this rain, I feel like I'm a voice in the swamp, Lord. Lord, I pray you hide in your word, Lord Jesus Christ. I pray you be exalted and lifted up. Lord, I pray that we, we, we would renew our hearts. Lord, I pray that we be willing for the Holy Spirit to prick our hearts to show us what we need work. Lord, I pray you work in my heart. Lord, this ain't just about preaching to people. Lord, I need you. I need to be preached to. Yeah. Lord, I pray that I apply what I'm preaching. Lord, I pray you help me. I fail you today. Lord, I pray that I will fail you now. Lord, in your name, amen. Thank you. You may be seated. I read about a fellow named Gideon in the text about uh, 